four different types of paint for linoleum floors. You are probably wondering what paint you are going to use. For a floor, you may want long-lasting, wearing, and tearing free paint. Linoleum floors are soft, so it requires some kind of paint that has a strong adherence. The following are the best paints to use on your linoleum floor. 1. Epoxy Paints They are made of epoxy resins and polyamine hardeners. You mix the resin and hardener before you start painting. These paints are known for their hardness. You can use these paints on the linoleum floor. They have strong stickiness and durability. If you're looking for bleach and chemical proof dye, try this paint. This makes cleaning the surface to be easy. You can choose this type of paint depending on how busy your floor is. 2. Polyurethane Paints Unlike epoxy paints, these paints are used on less busy floors. They are soft and elastic. This makes their application easy. Always ensure you clean the working area before application. The fact that they are elastics makes these paints scratch resistant. They are highly durable and you can use them on a linoleum floor. They can also absorb some low-impact strains hence protecting the floor. 3. Acrylic Paints These paints are cost-effective compared to the ones above. They are made up of many monomers. They are less durable compared to epoxy and polyurethane paints. For this reason, it is required to apply more than one coating. They are mainly used for decorative purposes but can be used on a linoleum floor. If you are looking for cheap paint to upgrade your floor, I suggest you consider acrylic paint. If you want durability, I firmly recommend not using it. 4. Single Pack Floor Paints They are primarily used on low-step floors. They are ready to use paints that do not need mixing with primers. Just stir, and it is ready for use. These paints are cost-effective. They are also easy to use and dry quickly. For maximum efficiency and durability, you should apply more than one coat on your floor. Always observe and repair any damaged areas for increased durability. 6 Steps to Paint Over Linoleum Floor with Valuable Tips Here, I'll discuss a step-by-step -step approach to painting your linoleum floor to look like wood. If you are looking to paint your linoleum floor yourself, I suggest you stick with me until the end of this article. We will give you hands-on tips and tricks for painting your floor. Step 1. Required Materials You need to have suitable materials for you to start the painting. Below is a list of the materials you are going to use. Mop Primer Paint Sealer Painter's Tape Paint Roller Step 2. Clean the surface. You need to clean your linoleum floor to remove any particles or anything that has been sticking on your floor. This step is crucial since dirt debris and dust particles can reduce the durability of your paint. Thorough cleaning must be done, so I suggest you take your time when cleaning. It will be worth your time. Step 3. Apply Primer. The primers from the above company are strengthened with enamel and alkyd. This makes them ideal to act as base paint since they adhere very strongly to the floor. A primer is a resin that makes it or paints adhere to the surface more strongly. You apply the primer to the floor using a paintbrush or a roller. An even smear of the primer will ensure even paint adherence hence more durability. Step 4. Let the surface to dry. After applying the primer, it is recommended to leave for 24 hours to dry. This ensures the primer adheres to the floor. It also helps increase the durability of the paint. Always allow the surface to dry for maximum efficiency. Step 5. Apply base paint. After the primer, apply the base paint that matches the color you want for your floor. If the color is not similar to the one on your walls, then start by painting the edges with a brush to avoid staining your walls. After this, you can now use the paint roller to cover the rest of the floor. Ensure you start from one end of the room as you come towards the door. This ensures you are not trapped in the room. Applying two coats of base paint for more durability for most paints is recommended. It is recommended you leave it to dry for 24 hours. 
Step 6. Apply top paint. After the base paint has dried up, you can apply your top paint. You just have to follow the same procedure as the previous painting. Start from the edges, then to the center of your room. Top paints are mostly oil paints, but you can also add a sealer to give you that shiny look outside. It also helps increase the durability of your paint. It is recommended to leave the top paint to dry up for 72 hours before putting any furniture in your room. Also, avoid going into the room before the paint dries up. Mind-blowing painting ideas that make floor like wood. If you want to give your floor that wood like look, below are some mind-blowing ideas. The blend in these colors will provide a finishing touch to your floor. You are not limited to the down ideas. Be creative and see how it turns out. A mixture of amber red and black walnut. Using the above procedure, you can apply the amber red base paint to your floor. Leave it for 24 hours to dry. Use your painter's tape to draw thin horizontal boundaries on the ground with walnut top paint. The results will be a tremendous woody look on your floor. Mahogany Primer and Mahogany Top Coat The color of this paint looks like wood all by itself. You just have to start with the Mahogany Primer and allow it to dry. Leave it for 24 hours. After that, paint the Mahogany Top Coat and repeat it to form two layers of coating. This will ensure the maximum durability of your paint. The result is a mahogany wood like look on your flooring. Tea Green Primer and a Red Cherry Top Coat a color blend of the above paints gives you a dark brown woody look on your floor. You use the tea green color paint as your primer and the red cherry for your top coat. This gives you an exquisite lively new look on your dull floor. Follow the above painting steps, and you will marvel at the results. Red Beach Primer and Chestnut Top Paint If you are looking for a refurbished wood look then these are the colors. The Red Beach Primer and the Chestnut Top Paint blend well to give you that woody look you have been yearning for. Follow the step-by-step -step paint application procedure for quality results. You can apply the primer twice for increased durability of the paint. Amber Red Primer and Amber Red Top Paint The following blend gives you a nice wooden finish on your floor. It has a light brown furnished wood color. To bring the perfect color combination, it has no alternative. If that is what you're looking for then you should use these paints. Make sure to follow the steps when applying on your floor for maximum durability. Red Cherry Primer and Red Cherry Top Coat This wood color gives your floor an exquisite look. It looks like a plank of well-painted mahogany wood. If that's the look you want on your floor, consider this idea. Follow the guides for proper paint installation, and your floor will have a nice wooden finish. Allow for the paint to dry before you can interact with your foundation. A mixture of red beach primer and chestnut top coat. This color blend gives you a lovely natural wood finish to your floor. It has an appearance of a well-furnished piece of wood which would look great on your floor. If you are looking for that magical look, this is the idea to adopt. With proper installation, I can serve you for quite a long period.